welcome back to another episode of Cold Sept Let's Play with Kepitaru and Hunger. Cold Sept Revolt. There we go. <laughs> so, uh, just a heads up, we do cuss. If you don't like it, now's the time to leave. Otherwise, fuck off. Yeah. There you go. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and start on the side path again. Because side yeah, paths. We do those. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah, Kepitaru, I forgot to ask you something important. T didn't you run away? Oh yes, I'll get to that, but I wanted to talk to you about something first. Do you believe in God? <laughs> God? Yes, do you believe in God? Have you accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? <laughs> Tenet, we have important things to do right now. There's no one better suited to helping us with important tasks than God. If you don't believe, then please listen closely, Kepitaru. Uh. <laughs> Look at that little hand motion. <laughs> oh, Chief God Gl Glottis, who created this world. <laughs> enough. That's enough. I get a tenant. Please stop. Why do you look so pained? You'll make God sad if you reject him like that. Here, take this pamphlet. <laughs> <laughs> Is this chief god going to grant me powers or something? If not, then I don't see what the point of worshipping is. Well, of course there are benefits. Look at this book I have here. It's filled with God words. Here, it's the Book of Mormon. <laughs> because I have this with me, I'm filled with bravery and strong spirit. I want you to. Sh I want to share that with you, Kepitaru. So if I went against you with that book, and that proves I don't need its power, right? If you went against him, are you going to fight Tenet Kepitaru? Yeah, I, it can't be avoided. If I don't, then this <laughs> sermon is never going to end. That's fine, Kepitaru. In order to understand God's power, it's best if you can experience it directly. If I win, Kepitaru, you have to listen to my sermons about God, alright? Okay, here goes! <laughs> we better win this one or we're going to be stuck in the church The beatings forever. of religion. Uh, uh, mass religion. The worst thing ever invented. Oh, man. The... Uh, hey, I get to start with a Kelpie. Oh, no. This game's going to end really quick. I need to get through my, my cutscene before you finish. <laughs> <laughs> this could be bad. All right. Holy. This fight is probably the chief god's... Oh, God. Holy crap, one. I rolled a one, two. This sucks. I'm going and to play... holy word threes me. I played corn. What a bitch. I played some corn folk. Oh, she dropped a corn folk. Oh, no. <laughs> this is going to be totally pornographic. Yeah. If you didn't say it, I was going to. All right. Oh. This is some pornography right here. I'm going to use prophecy. Get a creature. And it's not a Kelpie. Alright. Hmm. Going this way. I'm just going to pay it. Hey, that put me in second place. Yay, I'm in second place. Cool. You get all that. You can turn your... Oh, yeah, I should do that. Yeah, sorry about that. Hey, I'm going to go ahead and draw a couple cards. Okay. Hey, the perfect spot to drop a critter. Discard your cards. I don't really need prophecy right now. Oh, no. Ooh. The power mystic help. Ow. That hurt. There, we're going to put a copy in place of that triton that you just like smited. Mm. 
Gift is kind of counterproductive in when there's only two players. Uh. There we go. Hey, look at that. We're gonna go ahead and say that's blue now. Blue's good. Okay. And we're gonna drop uh, Triton again. I always hold back. So we're going to start by going growth body on the Kelpie. No idea why I'm doing growth body on Kelpie. Yeah. Yeah. Seems like a dumb move to me. Yeah. Why did they... They turned my, ter my terrain into one of those multicolored deals for some reason. Oh, I love it when they do that. I'm just going to water shift it. Now I can s switch another mod on to Vitality it on the Kelpie. Dropping another Undying. Gross. So I now have a 4 chain. You a little squelchy. Cheap. It's your turn. But totally predictable. The final game awaits you. You've earned okay. your next turn. You've earned a vicious beating. Good luck on your next journey. Still no Kelpie. See, I've got the Kelpie, but she used escape to avoid landing on it. That's kind of lame, honestly. <laughs> Isn't it though? Hate boner grows ever stronger. <laughs> She's like, I need to stop. She used spirit walk on a creature and then exchanged. Oh my god. She's celebrating about. I put her wall of stone to sleep, and she's like, "Good job, wall of stone." <laughs> I'm like, "Wow." Or he's like, "I, I, I guess tenants of yeah. boy." Yeah. I have no idea. Yeah. They, well, she's uh, Yuma referred to the tenant as a he, or she said, uh, she "said You're going to fight him." <laughs> so yeah. The so, penis confirmed. <laughs> Sad face. I need more territory. All right. 
right, here we go. And that gives me a five chain. Mm. I'm thinking that with I, me having to discard, I really don't need the Wind of Hope at the moment. Yeah. Sorry about that. So. Oh, wow. Now she's just like avoiding. <laughs> Walking the other way. Okay. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, I'm going to take a look at my Kelpie. I need. He's at 60 HP. He'll be at 80, so growth body will totally be worth this. There I got a call. <coughs> Sorry about that. Okay. Good luck on your next journey. Got a cough again. <coughs> Sorry. I may have to go after my second Kelpie. Uh, is they refusing to land on the first one? Mm-hmm. Discard your cards. Mm. Hey. Yep. Yeah. yeah. She's just like, yeah, I'm just not going to bother making laps anymore because there's a Kelpie in the way. Right? <laughs> it's like, I don't need to go there that badly, do I? <laughs> to the next gate. Wall of Ice. Looks like I'm just not going to get through here without... Uh, Doing something. The right creature in the right place. Discard your cards. It's your turn. Ooh. That was the wrong thing. I thought it was catapult, but it was batter bram help. I just fucked up. Yeah, that's not good. I lost my skilla. Damn it! I was supposed to put it to sleep, but it was a gar it, like I was. She was using. A, she had a gargoyle defending. And I was attacking Basilla, and I was like, "Oh, I'll use batter. I'll use a uh, catapult because it's plus thirty, plus thirty. Yeah. And it was battering ram instead. And I, you know, the cards look really similar. Yep. Why do I keep landing on her on his stuff? <sighs> hmm. it's so irritating. Never lands on any of mine, but I but I can't just I just freaking can't stop landing on theirs. It's crazy. So irritating. Yeah, I went ahead and dropped my Rahab. Like she's literally just running in circles here. Draw my Kelpie. It is of the utmost importance. Good luck on your next journey. Advance to the next gate. My lands grow ever stronger. 
Oh no, my Kelpie's now on a level five territory. Mm -hmm. Really? They, sh they shouldn't be able to do that. That's so gay. But that quintessence garbage. Yeah. Oh, change one of your opponent's lands to a multi-land. That's bull. That's too good. And the thing is, he does it every time, like, oh, and now I draw my Kelpie. That's so lame. I was just going to move it onto that land. I was just going to... Territory. Terrain change. Blue. That was garbage. Maybe waste 300 mana changing the terrain back. It's like, oh, there's something over there that I that I don't own yet. Let me get that real quick. Discard your cards. It's your turn. I am going this way. So, hey, she's going to land on my kelpie. Go get that Kelpie. You want it. Oh my gosh, I just drew another Kelpie. The creature's no longer fatigued. Yes. Territory. Exchange creature. Kelpie. So, here we go. Um, discarding Wind of Hope. Let's drop that. She's going to land on it. Yes. And she's Give probably going to use her Halo, her scroll. Or she's not even going to bother. And she's just going to lose a lot of mana. There we go. There we go. Discard your cards. It's your turn. There. Well, that put me well above goal, so it is time to end the game. Oh wow. <laughs> you are the winner yeah. Of this war. I'm gonna take a while uh, longer on mine, just because I just now got Kelpie on the field. Kelpie is kind of the thing. It's it's really important. <laughs> and what's funny is, uh, for those of you who don't know, Kelpie is based off of a Celtic myth of a lovely horse uh, that would meander around and anyone who jumped on its back would be stuck there and it would run t them to the bottom of the sea Yep, and drown its victims. Uh, traditionally, it looked no different than any other horse other than it was always wet. I do like uh, the graphics of the game going ahead and making it more of a fish-like or an aquatic thing since it is something that should be able to run to the bottom of the sea. Uh-huh. Uh, but... All right. How can this be? The Book of God's... Oh, how can this be? The Book of God's words didn't look on you. Oh, I get it. I understand. I understand, Kapitaru. I know the reason why you beat the book. You secretly believe in God. That's why, with that power... Don't come to your own conclusions. <laughs> I don't remember relying on God. I just fought normally and won normally. Uh, I see. So it was my faith that wasn't strong enough. I need to take my devotion more seriously from now on. Come Captain, her. sorry, Tenet. We need to go now. The enemies are already... Oh, that's right. Sorry, Capitaro. I slowed you down, didn't I? Don't worry about it. Just cool it with the sermons from now on. All right. Take care. Yes, may God bless you and Yuma. It's wrong. I don't need the blessings. We'll get by just fine without it. Instead, how about you just say you'll see us later? That's better. Bye. Oh, okay. 
I'll just stay here then. Maybe there's some pigeons that will hear my sermon real. <laughs> and beatings. Like, wow. yeah. Yeah, you can, you can see exactly where you whipped out the beating stick. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, alright, there's a, that's enough of that. Alright. Tenant handicap level increased. Yay. Go ahead. Land on the Kelpie. Alright. Well everyone, it's been great. Uh it's okay, I'm about to finish mine too. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you have an excellent day, week, month of your life. And enjoy. Bye-bye.